Back to that breaking news on President Jimmy Carter. He's in an Atlanta hospital getting ready for surgery tomorrow to relieve pressure on his brain. Natisha Lance is in the newsroom with us tonight with the breaking details. Natisha. Well, Aisha, President Carter was admitted to Emory University Hospital tonight in northeast Atlanta. Here's a live picture right now from outside the hospital on Clifton Road. We've learned from the Carter Center the 95-year-old has pressure on his brain that was caused by bleeding from his recent falls. Around 9 tonight, the Carter Center posted this statement on Twitter about the president's condition. Carter has fallen at least three times this year, a fall in the spring that required his re a hip replacement surgery. He also fell last month and ended up with a black eye. Right after that, President Carter traveled to Nashville to build homes for Habitat for Humanity. And on October 21st, he fell once again, breaking his pelvis. Now, we know that President Carter's wife, Rosalind, is by his side tonight at Emory Hospital. He will not teach Sunday school this weekend at Maranatha Baptist Church. His niece will lead Sunday's lesson. For the latest updates, we're going to continue to monitor this throughout the show. For Carter's condition, you can make sure to watch Morning Rush tomorrow morning starting at 5 a.m. All right, thanks a lot.